Hello everyone. Today in this video, I am going to explain the poem A City Sand Pile. This poem is written by Edmund Leamy. He was also an editor of the newspaper United Ireland. He was an Irish poet. He lived in Ireland. He was a folklorist and poet. Folklorist is a person who writes about the traditional stories and cultures of a group of people. And his first collection of Irish folklore was Irish Fairy Tales. A city sand pile. Sand pile is a pile of sand where layers of sand are put one upon the other. So before starting the poem, I would like to read the poem once. Children in a sand pile on a dingy street. Building men had left it there. Little did they think or care. Children small would find it fair and run with eager feet. Children in a sand pile. On a golden day, glory, how their eager cries fill the city's clouded skies. As with unrestrained surprise, they found that they could play. Children in a sand pile, life seemed all complete. Never knew they beach or sea. Mountain, field or stream or tree. God, be thanked that yet there be sand piles in the street. So this is a short poem about the delight and happiness of children at not only finding the sand pile, but more importantly at a chance to really play and enjoy themselves. In first stanza, poet says, a sand pile is left in the street by some building men. Building men are the people who are engaged in constructing the building. So a sand pile is left in the street by building men who did not know that their carelessness of leaving sand pile on street will bring joy to a whole lot of children who come upon the pile and they rush eagerly to play on it. This stray sand pile, stray sand pile that building men left carelessly. It was stray because, because no one was the owner of that sand pile. It was left by the building men and they little thought about which was no longer which was uh, this uh, sand pile was no longer of use to them and they did not knew that this will bring so much happiness to the children so children were very eager to play on it in second stanza the poet beautifully explains the children's surprise on a chance that makes it for them a golden day. So the surprise has the surprise of playing on sand pile left by the building man. Building men was a chance that makes makes the day a golden day. In the first stanza also we uh, saw that uh, the poet is referring to the street as a dingy street. Dingy street means a dirty street where nothing exciting is there. But there the children found the sand pile and it was and it became so exciting for them. They were so much eager to play on that play on it. And now in the second stanza. 
we can uh, see the words like clouded skies clouded skies of the city what does this mean cities clouded skies cloudy skies of the city means a city which is dull and gray and they and it offers little chance for the children to play there the children found the most interesting thing to play with the second stanza it captures the feelings of children so well that we can hear we can imagine and we can hear the sound of the children cries children's cries or shouting with joy as they play on sand piles so they are so happy as you can see in the picture itself the children are so happy while playing on the street so the second stanza gives us the feeling that how happy the children are when they are playing with the sand pile in the third stanza the poet tells us the children who have never known the beach or sea the mountains or fields or trees or streams at least they have this sand pile still that makes their lives complete their happiness is so much deep while playing on sand pile which fancy toys and gadgets will never bring so the children little know about these open spaces the nature but this dingy street and clouded skies on their city which was so dull the city was so dull the street was not interesting but that sand pile the little sand pile that uh, was left by the building men over there brought so much happiness to the children they were so much happy they were so much excited and surprised after seeing those after seeing that sand pile they were so happy to play in it in third stanza poet basically wants to show that the, the wants to show the contrast between the city life with nature open green spaces where not only children but adults too can feel calm peaceful and happy so this is the poem about a small thing which brought so much happiness a negligence of the uh, building men which brought so much happiness to the children that they considered this day as a golden day in their life they were so much happy they were so much excited to play on that sand pile I hope you all have understood the poem. I would read the poem once more. I'll recite the poem once more. Children in a sand pile on a dingy street. Building men had left it there. Little did they think or care. Children small would find it fair and run with eager feet. Children in a sand pile on a golden day. Glory how their eager cries fill the city's clouded skies. as with unrestrained surprise they found that they could play children in a sand pile life seemed all complete never knew they beach or sea mountain field or stream or tree god be thanked that yet there be sand piles in the street i hope you have understood the poem you will get the assignments in parent portal read the poem learn the poem and make a video and send it to your class teacher thank you